All right, guys, welcome to the shack. And today I'm throwing a file together. Brandy has asked me to build a miniature sleigh that could serve as both a Christmas ornament, a shelf center, random, you know, coffee table decoration or whatever. This is going to be a pretty good size object, but that's the size that she wants. So normally a lot of you ask me about, you know, where you get your files, how do you make your files? And this guy is, is going to be like the thousand <laughs> speed video of how I do the files. Now you're going to see some little things that I do and the way that I maneuver that you may not understand. And if this is the type of content that you'd like to see more videos of, be sure to put a comment down below and let me know that you would like to see this in normal time or maybe some lives, like maybe like some project lives like I did the other day. Uh, if that's something you're, you're interested in, be sure to let me know because I don't want to be pumping out content that nobody wants to see. And when I'm out here working, I actually get a lot more done when I'm not talking to a camera. So, but here's the video. This is in thousand speed except for a few little clips, but I just want to throw this together to kind of give you guys an idea of how I go from an idea in my head or Brandy's head to something in Lightburn to the finished product. So here we go. All right, guys, so yes, before anybody says anything, there's probably easier ways than what I do it, but you know what? It works for me. I went from an idea to a finished product in, you know, 30 minutes or so. Uh, I did play a lot of the clips in a thousand speed, so you probably didn't catch up on a whole lot of that. But as I mentioned in the beginning of the video, if you want to see more of this type of thing, only with maybe like some interactive tutorial type stuff, drop a comment down below and let me know. That is something I'd be willing to do. The live that I did the other day when I was out here in the shop working did pretty well. 
But if that's something that more people are interested in and I get enough feedback, then there will be more. Uh, but anyway, guys, keep playing with Lightburn. It's a very, very useful tool. Uh, and until uh, next time, be safe. Have a good day.